First foul of the game called. Colonials with a fresh clock. Spears squares up and floats one in. Khalil Spears a tough matchup for just about anybody. Meyer at the right block. Again, boxed out nicely by Stephon Walker. He'll switch and pick up Cummings. He goes baseline, but down the back door and down the lane goes Nate Jenkins for the scoop lay-in. Yeah, very Shot clock down to six. Cheeks will fade and hit from 14. Yeah, Corns are definitely a double team on uh, Khalil Spear, we were expecting. Cheeks couldn't hit the three from the right corner, and the rebound comes down to Ryan Wade. He's going to pull and shoot from the foul circle, and he'll get it to go from 16. Last lobs inside. Walker slices through a double team and banks it in. Ninth. Yeah, I don't think they win that game without Michael Green. Give and go. Trey James tried to break the window that time. It came off, and he lost his shoe at the same time. Yeah, he's playing out there one soft one shoe. Let's see how he does. Pull up right wing, good for Randy Tucker of Green Bay. Fast and furious here tonight. Wainwright, nice bounce pass. James with a slam! Now, that's a great pass by TJ Wainwright. They're trying to get it to Cade Meyer, but a pretty good job by Stephon Walker playing defense. Cummings going to take it down low, and it rolls off the cup, no good. Corbin with an easy rebound in the middle of the lane. It came right to him. Green up the floor. Pulls from the right elbow and scores a 15-foot pull-up jump shot. Yeah, a lot of times Mike down. Meyer was right in his eyeballs, and Wainwright finally gets a clearing. Launches, no good. Oh, wow. what a strong power move on the rebound and put back Stephon Walker. Yeah, he's been doing a lot of offensive rebounding for the Colonials lately. And He's a, he's a load inside. Boy, what a pick that time. Cade Myers just drilled T.J. Wainwright. And he did, and that cleared the way for Zay Blake to take that jump. Yeah, some... Here comes Green. He shoots from the corner. That's a three. For every three-pointer this season, Clearview Federal Credit Union donates three. To Green Bay works it around to the right corner side, and that's wow. a three, and that was a bomb that time by Davin Ziegler. He used to knock him down. Michael Green with a steal right off of the elbow of Zay Blake. Now he bounces off. Here's last. Line drive shot, no good. Rebound, hustle four, and Cheeks able to save it. Last again. There he is. Time. That's a three. Colonel's done a nice job. Just jump pass over to Hepner to the left side. Jack Rose in for the first time tonight. And Jack Rose able to connect. Nice to stay in the lead, Chris. You do not want to fall behind. Cheeks fumbled the ball, but he was able to stretch his body and get a slight reverse layup there. Green Bay. From way downtown, that one smoked in by Devin Ziegler. He ties the game at 22 apiece. Chris Ford's first points of the game. It's Gabe Meyer backing in, getting it off the top of the square. Yeah, he's a load. Michael Green, cheeks. Jump stop, hesitation, popper, good. Yeah. I'd like to see more of that from Eno. Ryan Wade working up front. Over to the left side, coming. Cade Meyer trying to set the pick. Michael Green won't let him come around. Khalil Spear digs it off the floor. Green passes head for it. Last for the layup. And the Colonials get a breakaway score. Yeah, nice defense. To the right side, Wade. Blake again. Crisscross pass over the left side of the wide. Open three, lost and hit by wow. Nate Jenkins. Man, that's good. He seemed to get his arm up. Well, here's a pull up. And the bounce guys are hitting tonight, aren't they? That was Zay Blake. And Green Bay has just taken the lead, 29-28. Jenkins has to save it from Green. 
Long three. Oh, did they zip that one in? Ryan Wade popped that one hard. Meyer. Bagging against Spear. Oh, a nice pass to the back door. And a good bit of patience there by Clarence Cummings, the second. And now Green Bay has its biggest lead of the evening. They're up four. Yeah, great pass. Great decision. Kate Meyer. Just, uh, really nice pass. Jackson last him over to help out. Pass bounces off Spear. Spear pokes it off the window. I said, good. Clarence. <laughs> He's got a <laughs> frown on his face after Cade Meyer shot that three. Jackson last. Green light from the right Green corner. Colonials back on top. Man, that was a huge bat. Jackson last with a good feed inside to James. He's at the right block. Hops around, weaves his way up. Too strong out the window. Last with a rebound save. There it is. With the three from the left corner. There it is. The Colonials take a 38-34 advantage with 15-23 to go in the game. Ziegler up front. This Inside Meyer, Meyer. And he backs it in. Yeah, you can't play that way, Chris. You, you got to stay in front. Here comes Green through the lane. Floater is on its way and down. I love that, I love that shot with Mike McCade Meyer. They're going to get it to him. They bounce it to him, and there he is. Cade Meyer scoring. You know, that time, the penetration. And so far, Green again. Came off the bench, as he always does. Hefner's back in the ball game. And Jackson last was able to keep him away from scoring, and then he tore the rebound down, his seventh of the game. Here's Corbin. Three Man. is good. Another clear view three. Josh Corbin puts it. The Colonials up by five. Yeah, Josh Corbin took his time that time, had his feet set, squared up to the basket. He'll drain it. Here's a double pumping clutch shot from the right side, driving in. Zay Blake knocking that one down. And Meyer was able to squeeze around him. Cheeks, great hand off inside. Walker with a finish with the left hand. Yeah, it's just a great pass. You know, Cheeks has to realize he can do so much damage. Comes Ford. Floater! Chris Ford! He saw him. He was able to get over there and block that. They get the inbound pass to the right side, and Ziggler able to squeeze it up to the window and score. Oh, yeah, they were definitely in position. Comes Spear. And gets a counted foul. Foul is on Randy Tucker. To the corner. Three point shot hits the side of the backboard. Uh, you got to come but up they with get it. the stick back. Yep. Other and other than, you know, when they let the ball go inside occasionally, but uh, done a pretty good job. Green hits a, a spear with a rifle shot pass, and Spear able to roll to the bucket to get it. You got to be smart. Just don't turn the ball over. Get a shot off each time, but then turn it over. Comes Cheeks. Nice off the glass. Oh, he knocked Cheeks. Smooth move. Yeah, he's... Hefner goes high low to Mayer, and that one is punched loose by Spear. Breakaway Jackson last, and he gets the dunk at the other end of the floor. Yeah, that's great defense by Clue. They continue to attack. Yeah, their, their only chance is to hit some threes now, I think. There's a little floater by Davin Ziegler. You don't want to get... Green. Runs inside out, last three, no. And the rebound to Cade Meyer. And a good look again. Clemens just can't make it. Having a terrible night from three-point land. Here's one from three-point land for wow. the Phoenix, and they zing it in. Clarence coming the third that time. Smoked wow. that one. They're down and 10. they make it a 10-point game. You know what Chris said? Steps aside. And they shut him off nicely, huh? Wow, look at that. That's his cheeks in trouble in traffic. Shot. He's going to pull and shoot an 18 footer. Wow. That's what he was doing in the beginning of the year, Chris. He was knocking those shots down, and he's been in a little bit of a uh, funk for the last uh, three weeks or so from the outside. Wow. Here's one that's not funky at all. Clarence Cummings, the third, zipping that one in. Clarence Cummings. Green Bay on the run. 
Shot off the mark. Green keeps it alive. Takes it down the floor. And lays it in with a right hand. Uh, you know, our cheeks wanted Mike Green to dunk it. <laughs> I don't think I've ever seen Mike Green dunk.